This right here is a power bank and is mostly used as an emergency power supply for your phone or LED light at home. Do you know you can actually build this right at home? If you don't know how and you want to know how, stay tuned and don't go away. My name is Enoch and this is Aztec Studios. Alright, so these are the things we're going to need to put together our power bank. First, you need an old laptop battery. You can get this from your local IT shop. Next thing is uh, a cutter. And we will also need a power bank casing. You can get this thing from Amazon, eBay, or AliExpress. Check my description. I've left you links to buy these things. And um, last but not the least, we need a boot meter. We're going to use this to check the strength of our batteries we'll be harvesting from the power bank. First things first, we're going to crack open our battery, old battery here. You can just hit it. Sorry for that. Yes. You have to be careful, you don't hurt yourself. So these are the batteries here. We are going to discharge them from their connectors. Really be careful you don't hurt yourself in this process. So that is that we have four batteries. Alright, so next thing we're going to use our voltmeter to check the charges from the batteries we, we just harvested. So we take them one by one to check the charge. I've switched uh, my volt meter to 20 volt DC to, to check. So I put my positive at the positive side, put my negative to the negative to check. It's reading 3.61, 3.61 meaning that the cell here is in a very good shape so we can use it for our power bank. If you get anything below 3.00, you throw it away because that cell wouldn't be fit for a power bank. So this one is fit. Put it here. Check the next one. Okay, within 3.5, 3.6, this also fit. This is within 2.4, it means this battery is in a very bad shape. Put it here. Check the last one. It's within 3.6, which means it's in a very good shape. Put it here. Alright, next we're going to put one of the cells we just tested into the power bank. Yes, let me open it up. So this power bank only takes one cell, but there are some on the market that can take two, four, six cells at the same time, depending on what you want to use it for. You can get any of them from the market, but for the purpose of this video, we're going to use this uh, power bank casing. So we'll take one of the batteries we just tested, fit it into power bank and we close close it up yes like this 
then we put it on charge for some time probably like some few minutes to get it charged all right so by now I'm sure our power bank is charged let's give it a test I'm going to connect it to my phone to see if it's going to charge yes it's charging all right next let's test it with a LED light USB LED light I got from AliExpress you can check my link below to get the item okay so I'm going to connect it to it there we go next thing I'm going to connect it to a LED strip that I also got from Aliexpress. You can check my link below. Got it for my TV. Let me connect it to it. Yes, there we go. Hello, guys, thank you for watching. Please don't forget to like, comment and subscribe to this channel if you want to be notified about videos like this. See you next time. All the best.